this Simmons shower valve was producing absolutely no water through the shower head because it sat for 10 years. I replaced the spindle cartridge and the diverter valve with no luck. I found the problem was related to clogged ports inside the valve body. This is the valve body with the spindle cartridge and the diverter removed. If you look carefully, you can see small holes around the inside of the cavity. The problem was found to be mineralized sediment clogging these ports. It was literally blocked. At first, I thought the problem was a blocked shower head, but it turned out not to be the case. I ran a snake from the shower head with the shower head removed down to the gooseneck and the vertical pipe to the valve body, but that didn't find any blockage. So I fixed the problem by rigging up an air compressor with a rubber hose fed in through the gooseneck and sealed with duct tape. Here is the compressor and the feed line, pressurized line, rigged up through a uh, nozzle and attached to the gooseneck with duct tape with many, many wraps to seal it. And then I applied pressure by turning on the nozzle here to blow out the sediment that's in the valve. When I first ran the compressor, sediment and water spewed out of the valve. Now that the valve is nice and clear, I will reassemble and demonstrate how it works. This is after reassembly with the shower head reinstalled and a final test. So I thought this was an unusual problem and this is how I went about solving it. Thanks for listening.